At five years old, Charlotte Garside stands at just 68 centimetres tall and weighs little more than a newborn. But the youngster, once crowned the smallest girl in the world, doesn't let her tiny proportions stop her from having fun with her big sisters. We've been told that Charlotte looks like a porcelain doll. She looks just like a baby in a pram. People still call her Baby Charlotte, which riles me something chronic because she's not a baby. She's five years old. Charlotte was born with a rare genetic condition called primordial dwarfism. At birth, she weighed just two pounds and measured a mere 25 centimetres. When Charlotte was first born, she was, she, when you looked, she was extremely fragile. I have said she looked like a skinned rabbit, but when I first ever saw what all I saw was her face, because she had a little pink hat on and she was covered in bubble wrap all the way right up to her neck. Mum Emma and Dad Scott were warned that her chances of survival were slim. Do it. Again, one more time. Charlotte's family want her to live as normal life as possible, and her natural inquisitive nature means she is progressing well in her development. I think I might be a bit closer with Charlotte than what Chloe and Sophie are, because like, of how much time I spend with her. I just see her as a normal five-year-old, really, that's just smaller than normal five-year-olds. And with the support of her older sisters, Chloe, Sabrina and Sophie, she gets to experience the same things as any five-year-old. Life without Charlotte would be very dull. Everyone says you look at her, she smiles, you smile back. It's an automatic reaction to smile back because she's just so beautiful. What does she bring to the family? A sense of fulfillment, I think. Um, she's just a lovely, bubbly child. And with a loving family and a fighting spirit, Charlotte has shown the world she can conquer new heights. You give him kisses. You give him a kiss. Good girl. Yeah.